What's going on guys, T-Mart here. Welcome back to another episode of Grand Theft Auto Online. We are waking up to a beautiful Thursday morning today. It's Thursday morning outside, I'm not sure what time it is. Nice, it's, it's Thursday morning in game two. That worked out perfectly, but anyway, well, I was thinking about when I woke up this morning, I, I, I feel kind of lame to admit this, but literally I woke up and I was like, GTA heists are five days away. Like, <laughs> the, the heists are coming out next Tuesday in before the release date is moved back again. I swear I will literally lose my shit if they push it back again. I'm just like, I'm pr I think they're definitely going to be coming out Tuesday, but I'm praying that the servers are going to be okay. I, I, I'm almost 100% positive they're just going to be completely fried and, and none of us are going to be able to play. And it's just going to be a big fiasco and, and people aren't going to be able to connect until like, you know, Wednesday or Thursday and stuff like that. And I'm just, I'm hoping that doesn't happen. You know, I'm hoping they've taken uh, kind of, you know, preemptive precautions and stuff to, to try to make sure they're ready for that. But uh, I think it's hard to, to ever really fully prepare for uh, for something on as big of a scale as that but say uh, yeah, I'm just I'm pumped man heists are gonna be a lot of fun I think there's what like six or seven of them to start off So I'm gonna have to get a group of guys together and bring you guys some videos and those things a uh, first thing So uh, Tuesday is probably gonna be like pretty much all GTA days so you guys should have some fun with that and um, uh, I don't know like I'm not sure how much the replayability is gonna be there Yeah, I, I wonder if it's gonna be something to where we're just gonna play them and then kind of be like ah, All right, we beat it, you know, maybe play it one more time and then that's it, but uh, we'll uh, we'll have to wait and see. But um, yeah, it should be pretty fun. Uh, we're definitely going to be taking those uh, into consideration in, in exchange of you know some multiplayer episodes. Uh, we're definitely still going to continue on multiplayer. I actually just got in the social club, got a bunch of really cool races and uh, and custom um, you know all kinds of stuff. So I'm excited to check that stuff out. Especially I had some pretty cool death matches I found. So I'm looking forward to that. And, uh, and then we're also, we're going to start up the challenge series soon. Now, I know I've, t I've been talking about that for a long time. I've been traveling a lot. I'm finally done traveling. I'm not traveling until COD Champs at the end of the, uh, the month. So I'm going to get the, the challenge series put together. Actually, a couple of weeks ago, I put a, a Google Form link in the description of, of one of our videos. And I asked you guys to send me, like, challenge ideas for stuff for us to complete in the episodes. So that thing's been filled out quite a bit. Like, we've got some really cool ideas. If you guys have any off the top of your head, I'll link in the description of this video as well so you guys can uh, can put your input in there. And obviously, if I use your challenge, I'll give you a shout out to whoever submitted it. So, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's pretty cool. Like, uh, I'm excited. We're going to have some heist to do to kind of mix things up. Whoa! I didn't know there was water right there. All right, that's not good. But, so yeah, we're going to have heist. We're going to start up our, our challenge series. And then uh, about a month from now, we're going to have PC, which is also going to be a ton of fun. So... Uh, it's, uh, it should be pretty good, but uh, like I said, I got some new stuff off the social club We have a lot of stuff from the social club. We haven't been using we've mainly been doing just kind of random stuff So I think what we're gonna do today We're gonna go ahead and, and try our luck at a random quick job And if it's not something that's gonna be like super uper duper fun We're gonna go host something on our own and, and hopefully we have some good luck with the servers So uh, anyway, I'll we'll see you guys when we get in the lobby. See you there Alrighty guys, here we go dangerous sky circuit non-contact race only well we changed that it's contact on BMX, Cruiser, and Scorcher are easy. Whip it, and Durex and Tricycles are hard. So let's just let's let's roll with the Scorcher here. I, I say we take it easy here. We got some some pretty high levels in here with us. Let me make sure we're we're all good. We're recording. We good to go. We're good. All right. Here we go. So uh, this is part one of a a two part race series, and uh, you guys can see it's gonna get pretty crazy. <laughs> This is just a giant freaking circuit race in the sky. All right, here we go. Off to the races, bitches. Let's go. So I wonder, we just got to focus on staying between the lines. Focus on staying between the lines. Come on, baby. Woohoo! I don't know what the quickest bike is. I don't know if the Scorcher's fast or slow. Oh, my thumb's, my thumb is getting sweaty. My thumb's getting sweaty. Woo! We got a good lead here. How many laps do we have? Two out of three. All right. <laughs> this is like, it's just wide enough that it's like, you can easily do it without falling, but it's, it's, it's skinny enough that it's nerve wracking. We gotta channel, channel our inner beast. Channel? We gotta channel it. 
Oh, yeah. I'm not sure if anybody's fallen off yet, but those guys aren't too far behind. So we got one lap. My hands are sweating so bad right now. Do you guys remember the Fear Factor show? I feel like we're on freaking Fear Factor. There was one challenge where they had to go like a, across a building on like a 12 inch plank on a bicycle. A foot wide plank. And I feel like that's what we're on right now. Like my hands are sweating like there's no tomorrow. We just pulled that. We pulled that out. We took first place and we just, we just took off. We, we, we killed him there. All right. That was good stuff. How did that guy just get wasted? I'm not sure what just happened, but uh, yeah, all right. So that was good. Whew. I was a little bit nervous. I'm not sure what part two is gonna be like. Maybe it's gonna have actual cars. I thought this one was gonna have actual cars. I didn't know it was gonna have bikes. So uh, that was kind of a surprise for me, but um, yeah, we did, uh, we did work there. We got it done. So hope you guys enjoyed and uh, I'll see you guys. I don't know, we'll see what, ooh, look at this guy pulling wheelies and falling off. <laughs> Almighty Alex215. Alright, so we'll see what these guys want to do afterwards. Maybe they want to replay it. Maybe they want to play something else. Uh, if nothing looks fun, then we'll go ahead and, uh, and go host something else up. So, boom! First place. That's what I like to see. I'll see you guys later. Alrighty, guys. Here we go. Dangerous Sky Circuit 2. You guys... Whoa! I was gonna say, do you guys see a difference? But I definitely do now. Wow! This is like an 8 track. It's like an actual eight that we're gonna be going through. Woo! All right, we're not gonna crash right off the bat. We're not gonna fall off. Here we go, we're back on the score. Ooh. <laughs> Just saw my mans eat the dust back there. Hey, we're gonna be hitting jump, son. Hell yeah. Woo! Dude, that's sick. All right, nice. So this isn't too different. The only thing is, is this is pretty much always, um. This is pretty much always, uh, what's it called? I think our spectator just left. It's pretty much always turning. There's not really any straights. Oh no, actually one of the, one of the other, no, never mind. Okay, we still got two races in here. I think there was one spectator and he just left. But, um, we're looking good so far. We're killing it, dude. Surprisingly, we aren't having trouble with this. I was expecting to have a lot of trouble with this as soon as I saw it. That's how we're gonna be doing, but, um... We're rocking it, baby. We're gonna see if we can complete both of these things without falling once. That would be pretty cool. Lap three out of three, all right. We need one clean lap, boys. One clean lap. We have so many great races off the social club. Since uh, the, the lobbies have been kind of like weird today and it's been taking forever for me to get stuff set up and get people in them and stuff, I've been adding more stuff off the social club in the time uh, in between when we're actually playing and we've just we there's so much good stuff that's been coming out we haven't checked it recently and it's just it's 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 pretty amazing what they've been able to do so there we go bunny hop to the finish line got ourselves two pretty easy wins there we we kind of killed it so uh, i'm feeling pretty good let's um let's go ahead and go uh let's see what these guys want to do next i'm not sure what we're going to be doing next wow look at this guy He's trying to take shortcuts. That'd be kind of, dude, that would be good for a custom race. We should do a custom bike race and do like really tough, like you gotta land it like perfectly type jumps. That'd be pretty fun. But anyway, I'll see you guys in the uh, the next part of the video. We'll see what happens next. And uh, thanks for watching. See you there. All right, so we got into this here. It looks like we've done this race before, but I don't really remember it, at least from this picture. Code 1391, urban race with jumps, tight sections, and lots of obstacles. Watch out for the Paris Marseille. I don't know, I don't speak French. Uh, Union, so uh, looks like it's a 2.45 mile land race. We got uh, four of the guys in here with us, so let's um, let's see what we can do. Hopefully we're gonna be able to get a win. Ooh, looks like those two guys are talking. We're actually in a party right now, so we can't hear them. Uh, oh, do we want to use, ah, shoot, I already confirmed it, I was going to say, let's use something else, I was thinking even like the, um, the McLaren P1, the look-alike type deal, like I was going to, going to use something a little bit different, but, uh, looks like we're going to be using the handy dandy adder, because I just, I got that ADD, I'm just, da 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 XXX, I want to play, I want to, oh, I do remember this race, this is a good one, alright, this one was fun, this one was difficult, but this one was fun. Are we doing laps? 
One out of six. Holy crap. All right, we're in it for the long haul. Really? Really? All right. I'm going to remember that, Mr. White Zintorno. I'm not going to forget that, buddy. You're fucked. I'm actually kind of pissed off. I don't know why he purposefully ran into me in the start and then ran into me again. You're, you're screwed, bro. Don't you worry. Karma has a funny way of getting you back. We're going to have to wait and see how it happens. But uh, we're going to make sure it happens. That's for sure. See ya. He's all the way back to in last place. That's that's all the karma I need. Look at these guys. Just racing like assholes. Alright, here we go. We definitely chose the wrong cars. And Torno would have been a little bit quicker on these uh these straights. Whew. Ah, I thought we were gonna Paul Walker him. go. Another jump coming up. Hey! Hey! <laughs> yes! In the second place. Let's go. Oh, yes! Damn, I thought we were going to run into something right there. We got a guy right behind us, though. We're going to have to watch out. Look how much faster he's going than us. I think that's probably because he, he caught a draft back there. But Zintornos are just, in general, a lot faster than the bug in this game. The adder. Hopefully catch up is on. Hopefully we're going to be able to catch up to this first place guy. Gonna be a slow and steady wins the race type deal. We're just gonna make sure we always stay in control. Land softly. Not like that. Woo! I don't know why sometimes our damn back end goes up like that. Let's go, buddy. We gotta go. We gotta go. What are you doing hitting walls and stuff? We gotta catch up to this guy. That's not how we do it, you freaking imbecile, dude. Come on, stop being a fucking idiot. Jesus. Oh, I hate people so much in this game. They literally have no clue what they're doing. Like, I understand, if we're in first and second right now, run into me all you want. But we're in second and third. Let's catch up to the first place guy and not run straight into the back of each other nonstop. Like, don't be stupid. Use your brain a little bit, okay? Shit. I was trying to push him into something. <laughs> I was wanting to push him into the wall, but then we ended up going to the wall ourselves. <laughs> well, I don't know if we're going to be able to catch first place. Because we've got an idiot in front of us here. Woo, Paul Walkered him. Damn it. Alright. Well, he's just now my sworn enemy. Honestly killing him and, and, and making sure that he, he does not have a good time is all that I'm currently uh, worried about. Are you serious? A telephone pole, really? All right, we gotta catch up to that guy, man. You know what makes me happy? Is that White Centorno is still all the way back in last place. At least that's the one thing we've got going for us. The bad thing we've got going for us is we're currently in fourth out of fifth. Granted, we are using a car that's not quite as good. We still need to step up our game a little bit. Shit. Oh, Trevor! No! <laughs> Come on! I feel so slow right now. Like, we've been racing well, but our car is just not catching up to these guys at all. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. We gotta catch up to him. Ooh, I see people flipping up here. Not gonna give us a chance to come back. Did that open the door a little bit? Shoot, it's not the asshole. Oh my gosh. We're trying to take these too fast. We're gonna make mistakes now. 
We gotta be slow and steady. Like I said, it's gonna be slow and steady wins the race. If you go through there and you don't run into the walls, you get there 10 times faster than trying to go too fast and end up hitting the walls. We just gotta take it easy. You gotta take it easy, take it slow. Four to six. Now these guys are gonna start drafting each other and they're just gonna leave me in the dust, dude. I'm not gonna be able to catch up to that. Look at that. Look at how fast they're going. Here we go, come on, we gotta catch up. You guys gotta send some good vibes my way. Send some fast vibes. I need some nitrous oxide off your guys' good vibes. All right, remember, being accurate is the key here. Let's go! Woo! Looking good, couple of good turns there. First place is still so far ahead. He's uncatchable at this point. Shit. Block him, block him, block him. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> that could not have been any more perfect. No, oh my God. <laughs> he ended up coming back. Oh, shit. I thought we knocked him off the side of the bridge, and I thought he wasn't going to be coming back, dude. I didn't think he was going to be coming back. I thought we had completely done him in there. Oh my gosh, that was so amazing. That could not have been planned or timed any better. That was perfect. That was just straight perfection. All right. That made my day. I'm, I'm happy now with, with this race. Even though we're probably not going to get first, I've got a feeling we're going to end up in fourth place. I've got a feeling these two are going to end up past me. They'll probably end up spinning me out, and we just we aren't going to be able to, to catch up after that. If you hit this jump in between the two right there, it usually doesn't send you nose, nose to the ground through it. There we go. See, if you just consistently do like pass-throughs like that, you get the win. But when you try to do too much, that's when you mess yourself up. Guys, right on our. He's gonna Paul Walker us right here. Yep. Wow, dude, he passed through both of the jumps. Look at that lead he just got from that. That's pretty insane. Oh, thank God we didn't clip that. All right. Well, he got a pretty much freaking. I don't think we're gonna be able to catch him now because he. He Paul walked us right at the exact moment that he had to. He skipped that second jump and that hang time is what kind of screwed us over. That's what gave him that big lead. Ooh, first place slowed down a little bit. Dude, he's gonna catch first place. I don't know what happened, but he's gonna catch him right now. Unless that's last place. That might be last place. Oh, no, it was first. Now, are we going to be able to catch them? That is the question. <laughs> We're in business, folks. Paul Walker. Come on, baby. Oh, yes. Come on. Oh, I don't think we're going to be able to catch him. Oh, the guy behind us in first place. I, you really blew, like, blew that, bro. I don't know how you could blow that any harder. You had the biggest lead I've ever seen in GTA, and I have no clue how you gave it up, and you completely gave up your chance of even coming back. Ooh. Well, that's how you blow it right there, Trav. You may have just blown your... You blow your, your chance at first. Man, there's a lot of blowing going on right now. That's probably not a good thing. 
All right, well, uh, that guy ended up taking first place. I'm happy with the second. I didn't mean to grab this uh, this adder. It's definitely not it, not a very good car for this type of race. All those straights. Uh, Zintorno would have been a much better choice, but uh, we're still able to get a pretty solid finish. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode of Grand Theft Auto Online. Uh, tomorrow's Friday. First person Fridays. Should be fun. See you guys there. Peace out.